Hi guys, I hope you all are doing great. I'm going to show you an Aldi haul, a few things that I picked up from Dollar Tree, very, very few, and that's it. The Aldi, Aldi haul will be really small, and I am exhausted, so I drove over probably 600 miles the last four days, picking up trail, taking them back. I just got back from taking them back. We went to Dollar Tree, Big Lots. Um, of course, we had to make some stops at the gas station. Mom and I ate at Smithfield's, and I'm trying to think where else we went. went to Aldi. So we are hot and tired and exhausted. So let me show you what I picked up. Um, you're certainly going to have to figure out the Greyhound Amtrak. And what I did was I called the bus. Was it the bus? Um, the bus service to see where what buses trail will have to ride and stuff like that so he can get home so um mama can't keep doing this because this is a lot but um let me show you what i picked up a lot of things i already had on hand because we've been eating out a lot because we've been on the go and my cousin cousin's wedding also was um this weekend it was spectacular she wanted a spectacular wedding and she certainly did that so let me share what i picked up um i got four loaves of white bread usually i go in there and they do not have it so i just got it anyway it was a dollar each so i got four loaves of that um mainly the boys or mainly josiah eats the white bread jason meal too and then also from dollar tree i saw this sign that said thankful and blessed so i picked that up and then i picked up some toilet paper two of these And that's the rest of the toilet paper. I mean the bread. And then guys, I did show this on Instagram. This is not even part of my haul, but it was sitting up here. This is my purse that I got from Charm and Charlie's. Isn't it pretty? That I have for the wedding. And um, yeah, this is just such a random haul of tea. And then these rose gold earrings. They were so pretty, guys. Very pretty. And since I got it all here. And it cost enough. I had a coupon, but they were not on sale. So it's really pretty. You can't, the camera doesn't give it any justice. And then these three bracelets that came together. Aren't they pretty? They were inside my purse, so I took them out. So pretty. And that's from Charm and Charlie's. And if you don't have one in your area, they have one. They have it online, too. So that you won't get confused, I'm going to go ahead and finish up from Dollar Tree some hot tamales. I picked, up, I picked up also some Dow white soap. And then I needed, Mama likes to pick this up. And so I went ahead and picked the sweetener up. The zero calorie has 50 packs. She said they don't have it all the time. And then I went ahead and picked up the liquid creamer, French vanilla. They also had hazelnut and a sweet Italian. I don't know, it had a purple label. So I wanted to go ahead and, because I don't have any creamer right now, and I don't really drink coffee, but sometimes Jason and I need to pick me up, or really Jason does, and um, sometimes all I need is a sip or two to just get me through the day, and probably also to wake up a little bit earlier now. So I picked that up, and I need creamer in my coffee. He can drink his black. I also saw this birthday cake, Cookie Crisp. Um cereal and I probably should have got two it was only three boxes left and I knew Jason will love this he loves cereal he'll make he'll put his cookies with cereal sometimes and or he'll put all his cookies crumble them up or he'll put it in the bowl like cereal and he will mash it up it's kind of gross but he likes it like that Okay, from Big Lots, I didn't get much. No, you're doing good, Saya. He's now understanding that I have to film, so he knows he has to be quiet or turn the TV down. So From Big Lots, I got these plates, and it was on something cold. So, these were the only ones they had left. You only with the oval one, but the circle one, they had quite many of those left. They also have dessert plates, and they have napkins, and... These say thankful, so sage green. And with the oval ones, you only get eight. So that's all they had. This was the last one. And it looked like somebody was trying to hide it because it was like this. 
all the way in the back. Maybe not, but I grabbed it and I said I'd go back and get the circle ones later. I also picked up lemon snaps. I don't know if you guys have tried these or not. Um, someone on Facebook, um, Brother Freeman, talked about these and Mama told me about, about them and she grabbed them to try them. She told me about them and they are delicious. They're $2 at Big Lots. I also picked up the extra, and I haven't picked up extra in a while. I know Jason will sometimes pick it up, but I figured it was fine. Um, this time, there's nothing wrong with it. You can get it really cheap. Um, really cheap. One of your couponing, maybe like a dollar or $1.99. This was $2.75 at Big Lots. It smells really good. The scent sensations. And so I think Mama got one and I got one. So from Aldi, I picked up some ice cream. This is the Cookies and Cream. It was $3.99 and then also some chocolate milk. And Josiah was like, I want some ice cream, Ma. And he wanted it natural. Well, he put, just said he wanted ice cream. And I said, well, we got to get the kind that everybody likes. And I had to dig in the back to get this. And I'm rambling. <laughs> I also got some white milk. And I'm just going to pull everything out the bag. And also the Boulder classic sparkle also some 80 20 only got one because i already have one here J josiah likes the gogurt so i picked him up the moo tubes to try those jj used to like them but um if you guys have been watching me for a while you remember jj used to like them he still does but he doesn't ask for them or want them as much i also picked up a bag of the chicken breast the traditional pasta sauce it's 99 cents they did not have the garlic and onion, I believe it's called. Or is it garlic and herb? In, in the purple bottle, they didn't have that. Tomato, onion, and garlic? I can't remember which one it is with the... I think it's garlic and basil. I don't know. I also picked up some biscuits. So the boys can have like a quick breakfast. The buttermilk and the flaky. The maple pork patties. And some panini to make panini I didn't want any spaghetti kind of tired of that and then also some Italian hot sausage I'm running out of space here then also I got some bacon it's the center cut and then some sharp cheddar cheese try not to move too much guys uh, did I leave it no I didn't leave it in a car some garlic powder and then some Italian seasoning I kept forgetting to get this and then, is this last? There's no one more thing. Uh, the vanilla sandwich cookies. Jason loved these. And then a ginger ale. And I think that's it, guys. That is it. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's really, really small haul. But I got a lot of stuff because I haven't had a chance to really cook. But let me show you this, guys, as well. Because I kind of showed it on Instagram, but not really. But my cousin made these. These were her wedding favors. And these are like marble. I guess they might be tiles. I think they are tiles. So they were already cut that way. I'm not sure I have to ask her if they were cut. And she's really good at painting. She's an artist. Really good at art. I think that's her major. And um, her theme of her wedding was Hawaiian style. It might have been Hawaiian something else. But Hawaiian style. And that was mine. So she has really good handwriting. She's going to be all artsy with it. That's my brother's. He didn't go. So I have his. And this is Jason. And Jason didn't go. Jason went, but he didn't go. To, wasn't able to go to the wedding because he had to watch the kids. So really pretty. And I thought that was such a useful gift to keep using for years and years. A coaster. But hers was Hawaiian style because she is a, a commercial designer, interior designer. She might be like outside too, <laughs> but commercial designer and she lives in Hawaii, but she's from North Carolina. So that's why we had the, the wedding on the East Coast in Wilmington. So guys, thanks so much for watching. Also check out her channel. I told her to remember to poke to record any little thing that she does and share that because I said people will like to see that especially her 
bridal boxes that she did for her bridesmaids were outstanding. So she is on my home page on the corner and her name is Lakeisha White. So if you want to see any other videos that she had made for her wedding and so forth. But I told her, make sure you record it because people want to see stuff like that. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye. I went back to Aldi, so I was going to insert just a little bit of footage of what I picked up today with the other footage. So I also picked up the spinach herb wraps. And they also have sun-dried tomatoes, so I was debating which one was better um, or which one I wanted. And I guess I went with the spinach. They are both 200 calories, but I didn't look at the sodium and the um, carbs and sugar and all that. But I, I tried the sun-dried. Next time, I picked up some provolone cheese, some Texas Toast 5 cheese. I'm making baked ziti today, baked ziti today and I'm using iHeart Recipes recipe I cooked it before and then also I picked up two cans of the basil garlic and oregano diced tomatoes and then I picked up one of the regular so they are only 45 cents a can and I know I only need one can but I needed some on hand I also got some premium honey smoked ham and this is all that they had I guess they're going to get a truck in because they didn't have any in and then I wanted to try, I probably won't like it. I think I tried it before. The Cheesecake Turtle, and you get two of them for $1.99. Normally I just have one of those. And they have it in plain, original, New York style. And they have them in the strawberry swirl. And usually I like the plain, but lately they taste different to me. So I don't know if it's, I don't know why, but it just tastes different. It don't taste like it used to. And then the mozzarella cheese, I needed that for the ziti, some pepperoni, and then I picked up a bag of spinach for my wraps. And I think that's it, guys. Oh, no, it's not. Some Parmesan cheese, grated cheese, and that's like two-something, and that is it. I think it was only $20 and some change. Can't beat that.